What's good, internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to my Let's Play of WWE SmackDown. Shut your mouth! The PS2 game playing it through a PC emulator, playing that season mode, barreling towards hopefully the finish, which should be at WrestleMania, which we're in October, and that's in like April, so we're getting there. Uh, but we are currently going to be entering into the Tag Team Tournament as Vince McMahon and Ric Flair have declared themselves the Tag Team Champions. And uh, certainly, as someone who is already undisputed, Intercontinental, and European Champion, sure, I'll take more belts. Why not? So, let's head into SmackDown here and see how that's going to play out. As we certainly lost that six-man tag match yesterday. And here we go, Hardcore Tornado Tag against Farouk and Kurt Angle. And that's fine as long as it's not Tess, because Tess pinned my ass uh, yesterday. So we also have RVD and Jericho fighting Rhino and Nash. And Hogan and Jeff Hardy, that's a weird tag team, fighting Taker and The Rock. So uh, I would imagine uh, as we advance here, if we advance here, because tag team matches in this game are kind of bullshit. Uh, if we advance here, that those could be some of the other teams we are fighting. And certainly as my tag team partner is Booker T, we are the Sluggeroonies. And, uh, we'll see how it plays out. Oh, Farouk, how do you like it? Here's, I'm shining up this truck for you. I'm shining it up real nice. I'm turning that some bitch sideways now. That's, that's somebody else, that's somebody else. Uh, what does Farouk think? Damn! That's, that's what Farouk thinks. That's what Farouk thinks. He thinks damn. I can't believe it. So, who's gonna smash that truck with what? With what? My favorite color. I mean, sure, you're an acolyte. Or, I'm sorry, you were in the Ministry of Darkness, so s certainly uh, that makes sense. Why are you getting in the back of the truck? Why are you jumping in the truck? What are you doing, Farouk? Wow! What is going on here? That's really funny. Welcome to the SmackDown Arena. Attack him. Don't attack him. You know what, Farouk? I'm gonna attack you. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, dear God! With that fucking solid steel pipe. Holy shit. Slug is here. Just assaulted him. This was a damn man, but wait a damn minute. That man has a family. Now, is that going to change our tag team match? Is that going to uh, take Baruch out of the equation? Because uh, he was in a team with Kurt Angle. I don't want to talk to for the Devon. It's over. What's up, William Regal? He's a man. Such a man. He's a real man's man. William Regal. What's good, William Regal? Ah, it's you, Slug. I'm not in a good mood today. That's, a, that, that's not a good British accent. That's a terrible fucking accent. I shouldn't do accents. Is he gonna call me a ragamuffin? He has something missing. Something missing. I don't know what, what he's missing. I have no idea. Well then. Perhaps we'll find out what he's missing later on and uh, head into this tag team tornado match. Hardcore. Uh, so uh, we will see if Farouk is too injured. No, he's totally there. He's totally there. So let's get on with it. Let's uh, get rocking with that. All right. So the hardcore matches don't have the entrances and I was totally having a drink here and uh, it surprised me. So let's get back to that. God damn. Totally threw me off there. Let's hit the old... Uh, there we go. First move of the match, Splash Mountain. First move of the match, Splash Mountain. Reverse it. There we go. That was uh, interesting, and then back in the ring. So, welcome to a fine Thursday, you guys, as we hit the Spine Buster here on Kirk Angel. I had somebody in the comments get like, was like, his name's not Kirk Angel, I'm pretty sure it's Kurt Angle. And I'm like, wow, you obviously weren't watching back when Chris Jericho used to mispronounce everyone. I mean, he still does, but back when he used to more prominently mispronounce everyone's name, and he called Michael Cole, Mitchell Cole, all that good stuff. But Kurt Angle was Kirk Angel uh, at the time. Fuck off, Farouk. I want that trash can. I want that trash can. There we go. Hey, Farouk. No, there we go. Hit him with the... Oh, God damn it. Five star flux patch. You can't pin. You can't. I can't pin him there. That would have that that been fucking hilarious. That would have been fucking hilarious if I had pinned him there. All right. Now all I ask here is that do not lose this match for me, Booker. King Booker. Do not lose this match for me. That's all I'm asking. Pick up the trash can. No, get. Pick it up. Get in the. There we go. There we go. 
Oh no! Now I am getting hit by the trash can. This is all going the exact opposite how I wanted it to go. What else is new? Just gonna keep hitting him until I got a finisher here, basically. Oh shit! Good grief! Good god almighty! There we go. Bop! Right in the face. Let's go back to the... Yep! Five star! Slug splash! Count of ref. One count. One count! And I get popped in the face. Anyway, yes, there is uh, news today. and Actually, some of it seems pretty uh, almost important. Uh, apparently, Paige! Back on Raw uh, next week. Which is crazy. So, uh, she was saying that the, the, the reasoning behind her suspension was that uh, she didn't submit the tests in the pro proper time frame. And that was why uh, she got hit with wellness. And she'll be back on Raw next week. So don't worry. More Paige on Raw. Now, how does Paige fit into the current, you know, uh, feuds here? With, you know, uh, Sasha and Charlotte and Dana Brooke and Bayley? I don't know, perhaps they'll, they'll do a Paige and Bailey feud. I don't know. Uh, that's always possible. What the hell's going on here? Salt Shaker on the outside, on that salad foam padding. Salt Shaker. What an impact. That's it. That's it, we're done here. We advance. Yes. Awesome. Certainly, I can uh, give my credit to the fact that I attacked Farouk in the back there with that, that big, bad, big ass steel pipe, so... That certainly could not have helped him in that match at all. Uh, and, uh, you know, we got the unfair advantage, but hey, that's what we're going to do to win those tag team titles. All right, heading into Monday Night Raw, the third week of October 2003. Let us see. We have RVD and Chris Jericho uh, in a cage tornado tag match. That should be a uh, bad Bad and Bad, Brock's fighting Kane, and Triple H and The Big Show are fighting Taker and The Rock. So obviously Taker and The Rock advanced there past Hogan and Jeff Hardy. No in-ring promo, just uh, backstage here. Devon's still like, come on, I wish somebody would talk to me. Sorry, Devon, not happening. Not happening, we've already had our ups and downs in these games. Uh, I was hoping for more William Regal, I don't see him though. Oh, here we are. There's somebody in the parking lot. And it's Rhino. What's going on, new tag team champion Rhino? I can only tell you about this. Oh god, what could it possibly be? What if I betray you and become your opponent? What? Dot dot dot. Ha ha, you believed. Take it easy, man. Just a joke. Ha ha, you believed? Man, this translation is a little rough. Come on, don't get mad. It was a good reaction, dude. That's... Okay, sure. That's, um... This game's bizarre. This game is bizarre. And that was all I have to say about that. Alright, let's go continue this tag team tournament playa. Holla holla. Now, the last time we had one of these, uh, I believe the trick was you let one of the computers escape because then you can do a two-on-one assault and then you can both escape. Uh, and that was how that worked out. Now, will that work out the same way in this match? Uh, no guarantees. We could lose terribly here and just be totally disqualified from the tag team tournament. Uh, that would not be surprising. If Booker T escapes here, that would be, be bad. And here I am, stomping a mud hole. Or, I was, I was stomping a mud hole. And I was walking it dry. Woo! Big old crossbody. Yeah, let, let RVD escape. Seriously. Don't, don't, we, we, we need to be able to do a, a fierce double team, hit some finishers, and then we can both escape, and then that'll be fine, because last time you gotta have both, both competitors must escape the cage to win the match, because it's a tag team match. Leia. Anyway, uh, speaking of Paige, uh, Del Rio, <laughs> speaking of Paige, Del Rio, uh, has apparently taken a booking at AAA, uh, which is surprising, if you, if you, if you recall the last time, goddamn Booker T, the last time he was at AAA, uh, he was their mega champion, and then left uh, while he was champion and made his su surprising return at WWE. So, as with anything in wrestling, if your name is still big enough to put the butts in the seats, there's really no bridge that, that, that 
you can burn. There's really no bridge because the butts will go in the seats and you sell money and sell tickets. So uh, I'm not super surprised that Del Rio has uh, some stuff at goddamn it, RBD at at AAA. Not the least bit surprising. So, but again, like he said, he's not. It's not. He's he's not exclusive anywhere. He he will go to where whoever is going to pay him money and uh, work a match for them. So that's what's going on there. Big old leg drop that I missed. Um. So yeah, let's see if we can. If you leave me in here, Booker, the Booker man. If if you leave me in here, that's gonna be a problem. It's going to be a problem. Like I don't want to hit the salt shaker and then leave Booker T in here, because then he will just lose his match. I can almost guarantee it. I can almost guarantee it. So I'm gonna build up more than one finisher here if I can. There you go, Booker. Shit. Shit. All right. All right. This is this is gonna happen. Oh my god, Chris Jericho, do not get up. Do not get up. If you leave me here alone, Chris Jericho, I'm screwed. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. RBD's getting up first. Nope. We won. Just that fucking close. Holy shit. Oh, that was tense. That was real tense there for a second. Won that match. Advanced in a tag team tournament. Alright, we are heading into the pay-per-view. Uh, I am making sure to save it here. As we head into one more show for the day, perhaps a bit of a short day. Actually, I, I had to record two today because tomorrow is going to be so damn busy. I've got to work. Well, unfortunately, we are once again recording uh, Perplexing Pixels on a Friday, and I don't like doing that. But that's just the way this week's schedule played out because of the whole thing with going to uh, SmackDown and everything else. Kind of fucked everything up. But here we go. Uh, there's a four-man battle royal. There is a... Uh, Bubba and Spike versus Jericho and DDP. And then we are fighting Taker and The Rock, which I would assume would be in the semifinals. And, and the finals will be, will be against Vince and Flair at the pay-per-view. I would imagine. Is there anybody backstage besides Devon? Like, seriously. What do we got over here in the boiler room? It is Chuck. I really don't want to know why you're hanging out in the boiler room. Uh, where's Mankind? I had a fan of- oh, I've heard this before. Fan event, line didn't get any shorter, etc, etc. What's wrong? One of the fans was like, well, yeah, they just talk, 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 and then that's the end of that conversation. So, I wasted all that time finding somebody else to talk to that was not Devon Dudley. Or, I'm sorry, for the Devon. Uh, and that was what I got. Fucking Chuck Palumbo, really? Great. That was a phenomenal waste of my time. And now we head into this tag team match. TLC Tornado Tag. So that's uh, interesting. Going to have to get the ladder here and uh, whoop some ass. So certainly they've given us some formidable opponents here between Undertaker and The Rock. So I can't see anything. And, uh, yes, they've, they've certainly given us some, uh, difficult opponents. Uh, but hopefully we can climb this ladder and make it happen. I'll get punched in the nuts. Anyway, there was, oh god, there was one other little tidbit of a news story. Uh, Splash Mountain. Wait, what? I thought this was a TLC match. There's no, uh, ladder thing to get? It's just because there are... Oh, dear God, Rocky, holy shit. I, I just no-sold it. Uh, so basically, there are just tables, ladders, and chairs that you can use. You don't actually have to climb the ladder to get anything like you would in any other TLC match. That's weird. All right, that actually, that actually makes it easier to win, to be honest. Boom, big belly to Bailey. Uh, but yes, there was one other news tidbit... And that was your chairman, Vince McMahon, uh, hurt himself while working out, tore his quad while lifting too many weights. That is like the most Vince McMahon story ever. Seriously. Um, and apparently got surgery, 
was back to work this, this, this same week. Which is still the most Vince McMahon story ever. Seriously. It, it really is. Um, so, that's pretty funny. There you go. There you go. Woo! What happened there? He was going for a thing and it didn't work. I, this is just this is just fucking chaos. To be honest, this is just fucking chaos. Get him, Booker T. Wear him out. Wear the man out. Aw, oh, goddammit. Rock! Die, Rocky, die? No, Sunset Flip! No. One count. Thank God, one count. Oh, big boot from Big Evil. That's not cool. Oh, no, I'm hitting my own guy. I didn't mean to hit him with a suplex. I, I, I guess Taker also hit Rock, so that's okay. It all evens out. No love lost between Taker and The Rock. There we go. Get him on that. Get him on that. That would be so fucking funny. Oh, crap. I can't believe it either, King. Damn it. I wanted to help out there. One. Two. Damn you, Rock. Why would you do that, Rock? What the hell's wrong with you? Face the... The targeting here. I'm, I'm, I'm hitting the bu Oh, Jesus Christ, Rock. I'm, hit I'm hitting the button to target. It's not always the most effective thing in the world. Get up on the... Nope. That didn't work. I mean, it did, but it didn't. Face taker. Face taker. No, big boot from Big Eel. Not cool. Not cool. There we go. Just Scott Steiner all up in this piece. What? Oh, that's fucked up. That's fucked up. Oh, he hit the rock with the chair. This is going to be uh, so close because I honestly can't tell who's winning here. I really can't. Rock's doing his bullshit. Spitting on his hand. Doing his bullshit. Put, putting a little stank on it. Putting a little st st stankonia on it. Goddamn. There we go. Jeez. Yep. Boom. Hit him off of that. Oh, Booker T going to the table. I was trying to, t to take advantage of that distraction. Didn't quite work out for me. Fuck, man. Side Russian leg sweep from The Rock. Someone went through a table over there. Slop shooter. Ah. Uh, the Rock sharpshooter is always so sloppy. Do not tap out to The Rock sharpshooter. It is sloppy. Get up. Damn it. Why would you... There we go. I'm getting this chair. I'm getting this chair and I'm using it. There we go. Okay. That. Oh no. Sure. Yes. Any advantage you can get. Damn you, Taker. I've got my finisher. But so does Taker and so does Booker T. So if one of us can hit our finishers uh, here. Yes. Hit it. Hit it. Salt Shaker. Now just keep him busy, Booker T. Keep the man busy, because we're done here. We are 110% done here. Salt Shaker means it's over. Deleted. And that should advance us into the finals for the pay-per-view tomorrow. I would imagine. Against, yep, we won the tag team tournament. Uh, and I don't think, Jim Ross is not a wrestler. Jim Ross is not a wrestler. We're gonna fight the owners, Vincent Flair, at the pay-per-view. Um, yeah, I am tired of all these hard matches. Who's gonna win the belt? Who? Who? Couldn't tell you. So tomorrow will be no mercy, which is you know poignant because that's happening in real life again after a number of years. Uh, pretty soon here, uh, October the 9th, I believe, which is like two days before the release of uh, 2K17, which is coming out. Uh, rapidly, and man, I gotta finish this season mode before that comes out. That's the plan. So, uh, hopefully, hopefully, uh, if I gotta sit here for an hour a day, uh, we're gonna get there. Uh, I, it, it, sh it shouldn't come to that, but we're gonna get there. So, that being said, I'm a tax slug. Thanks for watching. More videos every day. And I'll see you next time, right here on this channel. And I'm out.